Hi, I'm Brett, and that's our some of our video runs that we're doing on our new MY15 Subaru WRX. And I just had to walk out of the dyno room because it is quite noisy with all the fans going. And you would have noticed um, at the front of the car is the uh, blower that cools the air going into the top man and intercooler, which uh, thankfully Subaru has still continued to maintain on this new generation of cars with the two litre direct injection engine. And um, what we've been doing over the last couple of days since the cars arrived from uh, Subaru Australia is testing the car in its base format, just seeing how much power it's got. We can't drive it too hard because it's still a bit of a baby when it comes to kilometres. Um, but we've also doing a lot of R&D with the ECU tuning and sending that data back to uh, Ecotech in the UK. So um, stay tuned for more information about these video updates. Have a look at the dyno graphs that we're about to load um, on the, uh, our Facebook page, which you can see at the bottom of this video um, with a link. Uh, and also go to the MRT performance page and click on the resources dyno graphs and you get some more information there. The uh, exciting part from our point of view is this is a new generation of engines, the two litre direct injection engine, which in a lot of ways is similar to the BRZ engine, which we've now had in our project BRZ for over, uh, well over a year now. The turbo upgrade to these engines in a lot of ways is very similar to the Subaru turbo upgrade on this engine. Unfortunately, obviously they're not going to bring it out in the BRZ, but that's a different project. So um, on behalf of my team, where we are here in Australia and from you watching from around the world, I'm Brett Middleton. Follow us on Facebook, YouTube, Instagram and Twitter. Um, make some comments on this video channel, but for today, uh, get this video loaded so you can learn some more about what we're doing with this new MY15 Subaru WRX. Bye for now.